clearing course book. Read, study and note these instructions before doing any auditing. Clearing course instruction booklet mechanics of the bank. Anything in the bank that occurs several times will not erase unless it's the earliest time it occurred. This is known as the basic on the chain. The number of similar things, early too late in different points of time make the chain. When you have the earliest erased, the rest erases easily. However, when the earliest one is erased the next to last is the new basic and must be erased in its turn. And so on. As this goes on, the items of the chain eventually begin to blow. Erase very easily. Therefore, if items cease to erase easily, you have not properly handled the item just before it. And may not have handled the same item in the earlier run. Even if you get reads out of a later run than the one you are supposed to be in, you will find the later one still reads when you get to it properly and will then erase nicely. The real sneaker in the R6 bank is the person himself at the time. This we call the Titan in the item. Each item has an impression of the being as he was at the moment of the item long ago. If one does not spot this each time, it will not erase and mass builds up as we go along. This means look at or locate yourself as a Titan at the time of the incident. It is not a light. It is right where you are in the auditing chair, but of course, pages past. Spot means glance at. Q equals Greek letter theta. QN is a trick way of saying data. Then if, as you read this, you can glance at the wall, you can spot. It reads well. One man has to get the earliest moment of one's own beingness in the bank and spot it. Then one has to spot it for each item one runs. One spots the Titan and the item or in the objects the items, at the same time. This is a bit of a trick. It is simultaneous spotting. Spotting the Titan in a called verbal item can be done at the same time as the item is called. Ordinarily, one calls or spots the item a few times and then also calls and spots the Thetan. The Thetan can also then be spotted without calling or spotting the item. The right way is the way you get the most reads. Soon one begins to be an expert at it, but then one must be expert at it with item 1, part 1, run 1 or it builds up. One had a tiny bit of mess on him right at the start, as he was protesting. This is slight as it is enough to tie down the chain by leaving it with a basic. So spot the Phaeton each time. Spotting the environment at the time is also possible. Duration of auditing Find a quiet place in which to audit. Audit an hour or two at a time, preferable the same time each day. A day you don't audit is a session lost. Trying to make up the session is useless. Audit daily. When you don't you lose sessions. It isn't how much you get done in a session, it's the getting on, bit by bit, that counts. It's like digging a long ditch. What you don't dig isn't dug. The bank contains less than was first thought but it contains enough. In three or four months you will have made it if you do a good job on each item. And don't fool about with the bank. It goes into re-stimulation if you stir it up. And don't decide a lot of things. Your ability to postulate is increasing and you can decide the run is flat or doesn't need to be run and have it behave that way. But it will still be there to knock you down. The cause of trouble The only way one can get ill, or in trouble, is not auditing, in trying to correct the items given, or, in not following instructions. What doesn't make items read properly? Loud shouting. Body movement while calling. Fiddling the one. Hand electrode. Tensing muscles. Getting angry with the lack of a red. Gripping teeth. Auditing past an art break. Doing a list 7 every time you don't get the read or feel odd. What makes items read properly? Doing regular sessions. Not self-auditing out of session. Staying calm. Keeping calm. Keeping the auditor's code on the PCU. Following the directions exactly. Adding nothing. Finding dark breaks when they happen with a list 7. List 7 run as an assessment for dark break will run easily. Locate and indicate the bike.
past charge as it shows up. If you are not a class auditor, get this done in a qual division that has a class auditor either on or through the clearing course. If you really bog down, auditing by list 7 will give you the relief sought. Auditing in a place you feel secure and where you won't be disturbed. Audit daily. Not auditing too long at one time, 1 to 2 hours is optimum, closer to 1 than 2. Not trying to get rid of it all at once. Considering it a routine piece of ditch digging. Not expecting to fly suddenly. Not dwelling on your case out of session. 49 When you end the session, end it. Being plotting and methodical. Just getting on with it. Getting all the reads off by calling or spotting. Going on to the next item. If it doesn't read, get more off last item and return to the one that wouldn't read. Getting in the buttons sup, invul, protest, when needed only. Checking for earlier or later runs only when in trouble. Only handle trouble when it arrives. Don't try to handle it before it does. The best way to stay out of trouble is read, study and understand these instructions before beginning. Basic basic the first earliest bit in the bank is not an item but a light. It appears to the left front of the face, some distance away look ahead and to the left a bit and you'll spot it. It is the source of unconsciousness and produces it when contacted. There is a light before each run. In the middle of each 7 sgpm every 4 pairs at the start of basic end words, at the start of confusion gpm, and at the start of the objects and at the end of each type of item in the objects every 8 items. Each time you feel groggy, it's a light doing it. Each major change, then, is preceded by the light. Mark these in on your platens if they are not there. Flatten each one by spotting it. And it and statin. Then it and unconsciousness can be spotted away. It is part of the light. When the light went on, the phaeton went anaton. Instead of a solo auditor going anaton in his session, it is only necessary to spot the anaton in the phaeton when running the light. When you spot the light or object or combination of objects, you should get a read on the needle. By spotting the same thing again, you get another red. By spotting it again, you get another red. And so you continue to spot it, time after time, until no more reads occur by reason of spotting. You repeat verbal items aloud, getting a red each time you repeat until it has no more reads. Verbal items are found in the 7S. Basic end words and confusion GPM. But you silently spot lights, objects combinations of objects repeatedly same one until you have no more reads. You should get as many falls, etc. from spotting a light as you do from calling an item. Spotting the phaeton follows the same rules. You spot repeatedly until there are no more reads on the needle by reason of spotting the phaeton self at that instant and place. You don't have to see the light to spot it or see the phaeton or see the object or objects. You only need to spot the place where they are with the idea of what should be there. Of course, seen at first or not, continued spotting makes it blow.